，他那个重杨树还有果吗？那个果树比较少一点。At five o'clock in the morning, the Gibbon monitoring team treks along the steep mountain pass in faint dawn light. They must get there before the Gibbons start their morning calls. The monitoring post sits at 700 meters above sea level. People have to trace the high-pitched chorus of the Gibbons' howling sounds to locate them first. Then they go on to trek over 10 kilometers through the forests, searching the tracks for the gibbons. Li Wenyong grew up in a nearby Mao village. He used to live like his ancestors, who made a living by hunting. With ample hunting experience and an intimate knowledge of the woodland, he was recruited by the Gibbon monitoring team. The Hainan black-crested gibbon is an extant anthropoid. As a close relative of humans, it also has 32 teeth, its chromosomes, are one pair fewer than that of humans. Today, Earth is home to only 29 Hainan gibbons, who live in China's southern island province of Hainan, specifically in the Ba Wang Ling National Nature Reserve. They spend most of the time at 15 meters above the ground in the lush treetops. They are vigilant, intelligent, and playful. Occasionally, they spray the observers with urine. These denizens of the rainforest are super fast. Before you even notice the foliage shaking, they are long gone. Following their movements and learning about their habits can be extremely difficult. Today, the monitoring team is going to check if the infrared cameras they planted two months ago have captured any footage of the gibbons climbing the cables. A mudslide caused by a typhoon left a huge gap in the dense forest, preventing the Hainan gibbons from foraging on the other side. The team ran cables between the tree trunks on both sides and planted some sturdy vines to create a man-made corridor. This helps the gibbons roam freely in their rightful habitat. Having got used to the monitor's presence, the Hainan gibbons are not afraid anymore, which allowed the monitors to capture first-hand footages of these gibbons. This helps to study their habits and behaviors and provide a basis for their conservation work. The Ba Wang Ling Nature Reserve covers some 130 hectares of the gibbon's favorite plant food. Their living conditions have improved. The villagers in and around the mountains voluntarily became the guardians of their simian neighbors, and the Hainan black-crested gibbon is now regarded as the mascot of the Mao village. Earlier this year, the monitors were delighted by what they have seen. This Hainan Gibbon family has welcomed the arrival of new babies. <laughs> 